WhatsApp, Twitch, YouTube, Facebook Gaming, MySpace.com. All these platforms, one of them's dead, the rest are being assumed dead. But let me talk a little bit about some other platform that basically is starting to make an uprising. Which, by the way, if you enjoyed the video and you want to see some more sweat hair content, hit the like button and the subscribe button down below. And also check out my Twitch in the link in the description, twitch.tv slash hattersk. Anywho, let's get into the video. Today, I'm going to be talking about a platform that I've been using a lot that has been helping me when it comes to streaming. Now, let me ask you this real quick. Are you a smaller streamer or a decently sized streamer and you feel like TikTok or some of these other platforms are not helping you when it comes to growing numbers and meeting new streamers? Are you wanting to find an app that's like TikTok but it's mainly for streamers and content creators? Well, today's video is gonna be talking about Hover, not sponsored by the way, and basically how this platform has not only benefited me but also it could benefit you possibly. So a lot of you might be wondering right now, what the hell is Hover and how the hell, how can I find it? Well, let me explain the first part. Hover is an app that is set up like TikTok, but it's solely for streamers and content creators. Now you can still join it and basically find new streamers, but if you are a streamer or a content creator, this is a heaven for you. Hover is basically a platform where not only it shows you when you're live, but also it shows other people's content off. It is a more realistic system with less bots. Hover has been a good way for me to especially show off clips of mine and also possibly win some money. But the money part is not really important. But what is important is the fact of finding new viewers and especially finding new content creators to watch. Hover has been something that has helped me out, especially when it comes to finding new viewers, new followers, and especially chances of getting exposure. I've been using Hover now for roughly about four months and I can say this right now, the community is strong, I love the community, and they don't take people for granted. I've been using Hover now for a hot minute, and I can personally give some of my opinions off when it comes to the community, the interaction with other streamers, and especially the discoverability with your own account. So the first thing I do want to discuss is when it, co when it comes to discoverability. Discoverability on Hover is more realistic. Now what do I mean by that? Well, I mean is you're not going to get hundreds of thousands of views off Hover. Now you might get a video or two that hit 100 views, but I'm going to say this right now, not all of them will. And there's a reason for that. There's not as many people using Hover. Because again, Hover's not as, it's big, but it's not as big as it should be. Hover is an application that is slowly making an uprising when it comes to streamers and content creators. And personally, I encourage it. It is a place that not only have I discovered new friends from it, but I've discovered new streamers, and I've also basically fueled my passion from being on Hover. Hover has helped me out a lot when it comes to getting new viewers and stuff. One of the big things I've also noticed is how many new followers will check out your page. Any So on Hover, there is actually a place where it shows where your Twitch is linked. With that, there is a there's an area on your profile where you can click it and it takes you directly to their Twitch. That is awesome. You don't have to be like, oh, hey, go to my link tree link in my bio to go to my Twitch. No, you click a button, takes you directly to it. And it even tells you when someone checks out your Twitch. So you're like, man, this person checked out my Twitch. Who is it? Oh, they have a Twitch as well. Let me check it out. Maybe one of the best things I have ever seen with a platform. And there is also a tab. There is a tab in this app. There's discovery. There's your feed. And then there's also a live feed. And when it comes to the live feed, you can basically see other people that are currently live. It is awesome. One of the other things with Hover is the challenges. Each week, they have three challenges. They, they release new challenges. They can be clip of the week, horror clips, action clips, PUBG, Fortnite, some random clip, some sus clips, Among Us top compilation. And they do it with different streamers. And the thing with it is you would expect them all. Hover chooses the clips. No, the streamer who's going to be the host that day chooses the top 16 clips. It is maybe one of the best things about it. And one of the big things about these contests is you might be wondering, how do you enter? Well, all you got to do is when you post your video, it will give you an option to go to a challenge. You click on the challenge you want to do. Bam. There you go. You're in. You have a chances to not only show off your content, but possibly win some prizes. 
It is one of the greatest things I have ever seen with a platform that personally, first time seeing it, if Hover would have been around earlier and it wouldn't have gotten as big as TikTok, I feel like I it would have been amazing. But now let's go on to the next question, which is where can I find it? First of all, I will be putting my link down below to join Hover if you haven't yet, which by the way, use code HATTER when you're signing up. It helps me out a lot and it follows me instantly. That's another thing as well, referral codes. There is a referral code with the gravity. Now the gravity system has been basically shown as many different things throughout its life cycle. At one point it was to show how far your videos will go. Another way it's been basically, oh, that's how it shows how active you are. That's currently what they're saying. But currently gravity has no purpose. They're trying to find a purpose for it and they're actually looking for community ideas, which gets into the next thing, which is their discord. You can meet a lot more streamers there. You can even give them ideas on other things to add to the app. And they do check their ideas. Trust me, they check them. That's where you can also meet other streamers. You can get announcements for, hey, they're going live on Twitch for this challenge. Hey, you entered, you should possibly go. Hey, say you want a challenge, you have to be in the Discord to claim your prize. And they are quick with it. The whole moral of this video is basically hover. If you have not joined it yet and you are a smaller content creator and you want to get your content more out there, possibly meet new viewers and possibly get more traction, try hover. And again, if you want help with hover and how to set it up and especially if you want if you have any more questions about hover my discord is down below join it and ask away i will actually make a chat in my discord labeled hover help so if you want help just hit me up and i will try to help you the best i can but with it being said i'm going to leave the video here from me and the swiffer gang out here hit the like button subscribe also, check out my Twitch, twitch.tv slash HatterSK. Use my referral link down below to Hover if you have not yet. Use code HATTER when you sign up. Helps me out a lot. Thank you so much. And I will see y'all later. Oh my god.